Hi everyone, Balinor here. Today it's a great day for farming since we got both Orn event, both the Clure counts, so we get extra gold. So I got some buffs. So I have the temples from my kingdom. I got the daily experience bonus, Orn's bonus, and gold bonus. And that's the coming from the daily quests. I also got yeah standard ones so lucky coin etc. I got my brazier for extra view distance, far sight. I also got a Vulcan's brew for extra everything. I got shrines, hollowed candle for extra experience even if I don't need it. And yeah, the event as we said. In my view, uh, my world setup, I got full view distance also two of these few distance amities since I'm an oracle so oracle allows you to get to use two amities then using it not mainly for this but to have two supplement amities you probably should have saw those in my previous videos so boost two accessories two legendary band of gods I got two questing axes the chest and the helm for Orns and gold, so this is my dungeon loadout. So as I said, I'm an oracle, I have the concords, but yeah, for just for this video it's not that important. So what we are going to do is run some art boss dungeons. I'm using Gilgamesh, I'm currently using a lot Gilgamesh Hercules, but he has less mana and also he doesn't have the steadfast too, so and also not the skill that gives you mana back, so the siphon ward. So I'm just going with standard Gilgamesh for our boss dungeons. So we start with 109.4 mil billion gold and 24 million horns. So let's start and see how much we can get. Hopefully, we find a uh, berserk fallen fallen enemy would be really great okay let's start hitting sorry i got interrupted i was saying i was doing big damage to this guy because he's giving me petrified i don't want that let me buff please so i'm using yeah this third skill we got a phoenix redesign as you can see it's quite different from before Okay, these first enemies are giving good amount of uh, horns. Okay, so the buffs are Gunner, Attack Up, so Warcry, Attack Double Up with Bear, Elementless, and that's it. I didn't use any ward skill and then don't use it because I don't have much ward, so I just want it to stay up. I also got one Ashen Phoenix Adornment in my weapon, so my HP can stay up even if I don't have Berserk, so not that needed. If we get a Berserk Fallen enemy, we could die because I, we have double defense down and resistance down. If that's not the case, we can just get some uh, mana back if we get hit. This amount of mana is fine since I switched to three cut one for the first 16 floors, 15 actually level 250 so we have 25 floors and then i'm switching to sword play this is something i saw from mjolnir this run oh i didn't have the fix channel up unlucky i have uh, 11 adornments for oh this is a good amount of horns let me see again wow yeah, I would really like to get a, a Berserk enemy, it would be really great. So as you can see, hit me a bit, I got a bit of ward down, etc. But yeah, not not uh, not bad. Since we have the fictional app, it's not a big deal, I can even just use Tree Cut instead of Sword Play. Sword Play does a bit more damage and gives can give you attack up, or defense down to the enemy so it's really nice and if you have enough uh, mana it's really really good okay so let's see 
okay <laughs> good amount of horns also gold so let's continue with another one so let's do the so 112 billion gold 29 million horns 29.3 okay normal hard boss i'm not using ord because uh, my setup is currently not not okay for that i did some testing but not that efficient i take too much time i die sometimes yeah not not what i like also it uses a good amount of keys so yeah currently i'm doing this but maybe in the future i'll share my build for horde boss especially horde the hard boss is super hard super complex to to manage i would like to try with giga ursa but i still don't have it so maybe in the future okay let's continue as i said i'm not using word we just have the turns from yeah my class trick at one is pretty good as you can see i can kill everything up to floor 16 uses not much mana also i'm using elementless because in the boss runs there is nothing that can resist or is immune to this kind of no elements so elementless while if you do hard boss sorry hard dungeons maybe you have the couple enemies that cannot be hit oh damn sorry i had to use sword play hard to do that while recording let's go to sword play so you, we can see my mana at the end of the dungeon okay yeah my phoenix is not keeping my the fiction up but I am full of uh, Kerberos Eyes adornments, so it should. I cannot go better than that with my current setup. So anyone, no one can with the questings. Unless I drop the Ashen Ruby, but yeah, not, not, that's not worth it. Okay, so let's see. So we got 2 billion gold and four million horns just for one dungeon that's super good let's try with another one so art boss tier 11 as we said yeah as you can see questing axis with blackened eyes and one ashen phoenix in the main one the chest and the helm are giving uh, horns boost also gold etc my legs are full attack and have uh, thunder element and stun immunity double legendary band of gods double supplement amethyst so this setup should be the the top for for farming okay again another coconut rice <laughs> second one i'll go with yeah okay you use it <laughs> another one okay okay so war cry we go gunner gunner is not the best because it lowers your magic attack and also the magic attack of the ashen phoenix but yeah not a big deal we are not dealing that much damage with the phoenix phoenix can help keeping your ward turns up since the epic channel and also the other skills it has gives you ward turns and it can also clear some low hp enemies yeah why not okay let's continue let's see let's see okay they're going down quite quick we like it because of course in farming as you know in orna you have to be efficient you have to be fast so yeah okay so let's go with sword play of course since i have uh, i'm doing the hard boss i always have the diffuse ward skill i can use if somehow i get lower than 100 mana but shouldn't be the case you can see since i have a good amount of uh, ascension levels 50 currently and also have uh, good adornments since my all my setup is 
with superior or better dual soft creation, my mana is a good amount. Okay. Okay. So, let's see my good amount of gold and ores. Okay, I think I'll continue farming since I have all these buffs up. If I get a berserk enemy, I record it. So, hopefully you'll see another part after this one. If not, thank you for watching and good hunting. Bye. Hi all, I'm back. So, first of all, I didn't get any berserk fallen enemy and this one is the last dungeon I can run uh, before my buffs end up because I'm in a portal, but yeah. I indeed all the dungeons, so I wanted to say a couple things anyway. So the first of all is I have Wisp Heal 2, so if I get Burn mainly I use it because Burn deals a good amount of damage per turn, also lowers your attack. The second thing is Warding Strikes. I have 3, it was unlocked before. It's uh, a good multi-hitting skill, it also has a decent amount of penetration for multi hitting skill and it's quite useful also for another thing because in this case for example you have three war turns and maybe you get you get up to you get down to one and guardian strikes also gives you a couple of war turns back so it is a good amount of damage it costs not too much mana so you can use it for getting war turns and also decent damage so, ooh, low HP, Fallen Realm Shifter, and didn't get the stun. Not good for me, okay. Let's go. Yeah, my mana is quite low now. Let's see if I have to defuse ward. No, okay. So, let's take a look at my current situation so yeah i have 20 minutes more of the coins etc i have 81.8 million orns 139 billion gold so sorry as i said this is my world loadout so full view distance gunless setup this one so let's see also the stats so view distance is more than 1000 meters while my gauntlet has more than 5k attack, a bit of defense resistance, mana 1.8k, k, almost 20k HP, and as I said, my ascension level is 50. I have all the buffs possible, I think, should be. So yeah, let's see. This is a dungeon from a friend of mine in my kingdom, kingdom family, so Yotunheim family. No, I think it's it's fine for now. So, that's it for today. Thank you again for watching. Bye.